I think what's really weighing on Lindsay right now is, you know, coming home out of prison and not being able to see her daughter. <sighs> so I told her I have a little bit of a surprise for her. You hear almost here? Oh, here they are. Here they come. Here they come. They're coming? Yeah, right now. They're coming. There she is. Hi, baby. I miss you, baby. I miss you, too. I'm so glad I'm home. I'm excited. I do. I can't wait for you to come over. Scott's working on your bedroom. And you have to come and take care of these dogs because they drive me crazy. We got a new sheriff in town. Mom's making big rules with the dogs now. <laughs> I'm really excited that my mom's home. Today's the first day I get to see my mom in years. Talking through the glass, I was kind of sad because when she was in prison, we did video calls, so now that she's home, I just want to reach the glass. I love your hair like that. I'm so glad you got it done, ombre. Hope she stays home and stays out of trouble. I have noticed how tall she's gotten. You're four eight. That's crazy. Yeah, it is. I don't know where you got your height from because it sure wasn't your daddy. I started dating Miley's dad when I was 14. And at 15, I got pregnant. But after getting arrested, it's not only that I was gone, but after I left for prison, Miley's dad fell off on her. He completely has faded out of her life to almost a non-existent point. Like, how does that not just break your heart when your 10-year-old's on the phone saying that her dad doesn't love her and her mom is gone? And I caused that. I caused me being gone. <laughs>